More pet owners in Oklahoma City are struggling to keep their pets safe during this extreme heat, especially one pesky problem. News Force Taylor Mitchell tells us what one vet is seeing a lot of this summer. Summertime is one of the most active times for fleas and ticks. Vets tell me the problem is only getting worse. Now animal hospitals in Oklahoma City are seeing a rise in pet owners scheduling appointments. Sherry Payne at Rock Knoll Animal Hospital tells me the spike is due to extreme temperatures and lack of moisture in the soil. Pets can get fleas or ticks by simply playing in the dirt outside or from the grass in your yard. I always recommend flea and tick product year round in Oklahoma because of those issues. Tick disease is bad. Um, they can actually die from it. There are many different options to get rid of fleas and ticks on your pet. A popular one includes giving them a flea and tick bath, but once you get rid of them on your pet, you also need to do so in your living space. Humans can get fleas too if you don't get rid of them from your environment. Payne says if you see one flea or tick on your pet, there's likely 99 others hiding in your home and car. They can lay anywhere from 9,000 to 50,000 eggs at a time, okay? So there are lots of them out there. You have to make sure the environment is getting treated. Okay, so you have product for your home. It's, one of them is called Knockout, all right, and, and it, once it dries, it's pretty safe, but what you do is you have to vacuum your floors everywhere, okay, throw it away outside because they can get out of vacuum bags or your trash cans and that kind of stuff. A product Payne suggests using on your pet is Brevecto, which is a chewable that kills fleas and ticks for your dogs and puppies. You can also use a spray or a flea and tick collar. Talk with your vet for advice when treating your pet. Taylor Mitchell, Oklahoma's News 4. Some signs that your pet may have fleas or ticks, severe scratching and itching, biting and chewing of the skin, and scabs or red irritation.